Good morning. Well, it's Friday. We had our rest day yesterday. And uh, this boy, he, uh, he did not go into the van until it was bedtime. So he was able to be out and about and he slept the majority of the time. But I think <clears throat> it's just the difference that he's not in the van. And he's able to get up and move around and change spots when he wants to. So we did some, I did some pulling stuff out, putting things back in their place and um, cleaned the carpet a bit because of the, you know, getting in and out with wet feet and dirty shoes and whatnot. The, um, and lo and behold, didn't I spill something on it last night? And I was like, oh, I'm not winning this battle. <laughs> so it's like... Uh, that carpet. The thing is about that carpet, it's just something I bought from Walmart, but it is washable. So when I get home, I'll, I'll pull it out and we'll see if I can get it to do what it's supposed to do. But right now it is what it is. I'm going to have to give it a quick spot cleaning anyways, because it was soda. So that's got that sweet sticky stuff. And it'll track down. So... That being said, there's part of me, do I go down to the Burn Peninsula? Or do I just start making my way up? And I'm not looking forward to driving the highways. I really like going into the coves and whatnot, and I'm just, maybe I should have taken an extra day off. But first things first, I'm gonna to go to the car wash get the vehicle wash. I bought some that, it's called remover. It's a bug and tar remover. So it will get a bunch of the crap off as, on the vehicle. And other than that, i um, just waiting for a call back from a, an RV place. I'm not sure if they take RVs, but they're apparently cottages are a hundred bucks according to the website. So $40 versus a hundred bucks. That's like, I'm inclined to say, let's go for it. But we'll have to see if they have a spot. I pref prefer to stick to the 40. If not, I'm boondocking tonight if they don't have anything, which is fine. Except for I'm heading south, which means it's cooler. So it was nice last night. The weather is warmed up here and really didn't need the heater on much. And um, yeah, no, it was it was nice. It was a good spot I had. Surprisingly, for an RV park inside the city, and um, and this was Western something. I have to put a link into. I didn't even know it. It didn't show up when I when I booked at Peppy. It didn't even show up. Waterfront RV park. It's in Mount Pearl. So. I prefer it over Pippi, but people will like Pippi because it's closer to the downtown St. John stuff. So, anywho, um, prior to getting back to St. John's, I was down in the <coughs> Avalon Peninsula, and the whales right now are putting on a show in St. Vincent's, and I was just there. So. That means the Kaplan's starting to return, but it'll hit the southern part. So now I'm, I'm torn. Do I go down to the Burn Peninsula, because they've got whales going on down there, or do I go up where all the iceberg activity is going on? I've seen some icebergs, but I haven't seen some whales yet. So maybe it's the whales. <clears throat> I, I think I would regret not going into the, taking that drive on the Burn Peninsula. It's kind of like the Irish Loop. That was so beautiful. And I've got some great videos coming up on that as well. So I'm, I'm by far not even caught up on videos. There's just so much to go through. So it's, um, I'll get there. I'll be in uh, Nova Scotia before I get Newfoundland finished. That'll jump my mind. Anyways, folks, thanks for watching. Please comment if you have any questions.
uh, the comments do help and um, I hit the 60 subscriber mark I'm still shooting for that first 100 so please share and ask people to subscribe I would very much appreciate it